We're back with more Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time. It is now time to go inside Lord Jabu Jabba's belly and find out what's making this big fish queasy. Don't worry, Navi. I got him. Anyway, the wooden shield, or Kokira shield, is going to be a blessing in disguise in here because we are going to encounter a lot, and I mean a lot, of Octoroks. And at the same time, equipped as we are, a lot of the enemies are going to be posing a big problem. Namely because a lot of enemies are electrified and we will not be able to do anything about it. Case in point, these jellyfish. If we swing at them with our sword, it's going to mean big trouble. So we're going to need to find the item in the dungeon in order to do something about them. But that will come in due time. As for Princess Ruto... There she is! Of course, it's not that easy. You! Who are you? I am Ruto, Princess of the Zoras! What? Are you saying my father asked you to come here to save me? I'd never ask anyone to do such a thing! Well, excuse me, princess! Better in a bottle? I have no idea what you're talking about! Uh, your father said it was your writing. My father is worried about me? I don't care! Anyway, I can't go home right now, and you, get out of here! Understood? Fine, be that way. Oh no! Well, I guess we better do something. It's just like Link to put the needs of others before his own. Are you still hanging around here? I told you to go away! I'm okay. I've been going inside Lord Jabu Jabu's belly since I was a little... But... Lord Jabu Jabu is very strange today. There are electrified jellyfish and strange holes around... On top of that, my personal stone was... But... That's none of your business, anyway! You! Go home now! Understand? I get what you're saying, but I'm not going anywhere. You're that worried about me? Then I will give you the honor of carrying me. However, I won't leave until I find the thing I'm looking for. You better believe me. All right, all right. Pick you up. Oh, but that jellyfish is getting a little too close for comfort. See what I mean? It electrifies you. All right, I gotcha. Don't worry, Ruto. We'll find what you're looking for, and we'll get out of here in due time. No, I do not want to deal with that thing. Or that one. Okay. Hang on here for a second. Thanks for being a good sport. Ugh. Okay, there we go. We need to raise the water to go up. But rather... Ugh. Fucking bastard. This is why I need it to go up. The gold spider. Right. Don't move. Ah, missed. Come on! Oh, come on, I'm standing right above it. Why can't I hit it? Mm. Maybe if I stand a little over here. Oh, come on, I'm standing right above it and I'm wasting bullets! Okay, I don't have them in sight. Okay, there we go. I got him. Now, before we go get the token, I'm switching out to an empty bottle. Because... We got our first fairy of the game. And if you can believe it... Oops. Yeah. Anyway, as I was saying... If you get knocked out by enemies, a fairy will actually revive you. Thank you. Okay, let's go back to... Shit. Gotta hit the switch again. Oh boy, I tell you, this is going rather swimmingly. Nice. Okay. There we go. Alright. 
let's continue. With Bruto in tow, she's actually going to be pulling her weight. Quite literally, because... Oops. Excuse me for a second. Need to pull up my slingshot again. There we go. Alright, your royal bitchiness. Let's get going. Oh boy. Don't worry, Navi. I got him. Yeah, so far out of the three dungeons we've been in, this one is going to be the most combat intensive. Oh yes. And if you saw that cave in the water, there is a business scrub under there. Unfortunately, he's useless. He sells you Deku Nuts, an item which I do not use at all. Rather, we're going to go back to the room where we originally found Princess Bruto, and we're going to run straight across, avoiding all the holes in the process. And all the jellyfish as well. Inclu including whatever that is. Of course, it already caught me on the backswing. <sighs> and now we've got ourselves yet another nasty enemy. Grabby things that look like land molas. Like the jellyfish, they're also electrified. Oh, shut up, Navi! I know I can't press it with my own weight. That's exactly why I brought Ruto with me. Now, if you don't mind, even if you do mind, shut up! Looks like we've got company. Not exactly sure what's in here. Oh, they're manta rays. Gotcha. There's another one. You little bastard. I wonder. What if I pull my slingshot out? Still in the air. A little bastard dive bombed. Gotcha. Come on, get out and face me like a man. What is the matter, you chicken shit? Get out of here. One shot, and two. Last one. Get out here. Try a spin attack. Ah, missed. There we go. I do not like those mantle rays. They're always so tough to hit. But at least we got ourselves a big treasure box. And if I'm not mistaken, this one is going to be the treasure of the dungeon. Which is funny because we don't fight a mini boss for it. It's the boomerang. And about time too, because this is actually one of the most useful items you can have as a kid. Alright. Thanks for staying put. I appreciate it. No, seriously, I mean that. Okay. Now to go to the other side, past these grabby enemies. I do not like these things. How many of them are there? Okay, now this is where Ruto really comes in handy. Just drop on the switch, and the door stays open. Okay. Now it's time to put the boomerang to good use. Take a couple steps closer. Aim at the skinny part. Not close enough. There we go. Come on. Get down here, you little bitch. Come on. Stop being a chicken. What 
What is your problem? There we go. <sighs> this thing is really, really annoying. Oh, look at that. Another big treasure box. Although, if I'm not mistaken, this one's probably just the map. Or the compass. Either way, we'll see. It's the map. Bloody freaking da. Unfortunately, now that we're done here, well, it's sort of a double-edged sword. For starters, by killing that tentacle thing, a couple of electro blocks have been moved. But at the same time, Princess Ruto has gone back to resting bitch face mode and is a little disappointed for leaving us. Or for leaving her. She says, How inconsiderate! How could you leave me behind? If you're a man, act like one. Take responsibility! Oh, kind of like you when you made your father worry sick about you? You stupid, stupid bitch. Shut up, Navi. That's exactly why I killed the tentacle. Now, will you please just fuck off? Ugh. Why did I ever agree to have you... Great. We're trapped in here. Don't move, Ruto. Ugh. Got it. God, time's running out. Okay, that's good. Looks like I have two more to go. Okay, I don't need the magic jar. Oh, there's the bubble. Get her. Okay. Just in the nick of time. Although one has to wonder, what happens if time does run out? Not that it matters, after all. I did the job, I killed all the bubbles, and I opened the treasure box. All that for the compass. Okay, let's go. That's right, Ruto. I'm taking you with me. And don't worry, we'll find your stupid stone. Move, 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 move! Oh, this thing is actually still up and running. If I'm not mistaken, this one should be dead. Yup. And we have ourselves yet another tentacle to chop. Alright. Hit. Two hits. Three hits. At least this one was somewhat cooperative. Okay. Let's go. You know, Ruto, all things considered, you're actually being very cooperative. I would have expect I would have expected you to be a bit more of a bitch. But then again. Ah, oh, great. A tentacle and jellyfish. Gotcha! And you can go suck a bag of dicks yourself. Alright, so we've taken out three of those tentacles. If I'm not mistaken, the one we just killed now, that should kill the one in the main room just outside of this intersection hallway. So we'll run past these electro worm things. And just past here... You know what? 
Stay here for a second. I see, I gotta stun it every time. Ooh, sneaky little bastard. Splits into three little jellyfish. Don't touch! Okay, Rudo, let's go. Ah, perfect. Don't worry. It's all good. Stay put for a second. I hear spiders crawling. Oh, there's two of them! Better get a little closer. There's one down. I always thought this was kind of weird. You can lock onto the token, but not the spider itself. I never understood that, but... I guess it's no big deal. Ah, missed. There we go. Come to Papa. Thank you very much. You know, if I'm not mistaken, this is probably the first dungeon in which you can easily clear out all the gold skulltulas. I'm not entirely positive, but I think I may have missed a spider in this room. If I did, fine. If not, no big deal. Anyway. Come on, Ruto. We've got work to do. And I remember you want that stone. Son of a bitch, there it is! That's it! That's what I've been looking for! Throw me up there! Onto the platform! Okay, okay, keep your pants on. Are you happy now? <laughs> Princess Ruto got the spiritual stone. But why, Princess Ruto? Oh my goodness! I finally found my mother's stone! I got very upset when Lord Jabu Jabu swallowed it. While I was feeding him, he suddenly swallowed me. I was so, so surprised I dropped it inside. But now that I've found it, I don't need to be in here anymore. So, take me home right now. Okay. Or not. Yeah! What is this? An octopus? Uh-oh. It's fight time. Our mini boss of Jabu Jabu is known as the Big Octo. Hey, I... Wait a second, I've already got Din's Fire set. Will Din's Fire do anything? Let's see. No, it does not. Get back here, you sick son of a bitch! Come on. Come on. Stop jerking me around. I want to cut you into sushi. Specifically, a nice big plate of sashimi. Almost in range. Almost in range. Alright, now you're mine. Okay. Oh, can't touch the sides. This sucks. Alright, now I can shut up. Missed him. Alright, so we do it all over again. We chase, and then we chop. Is it just me or did he get a little bit faster? Probably just my imagination. Come on. Get back here. He's almost to range. I'm losing him. I'm gaining him. I'm gaining on him. 
Now he's way ahead of me. Yeah, that wasn't so smart. Get back here, you stupid octopus. It's copped up. In the ground. Now you're mine! Oh, come on, that didn't do it! Oh, that did do it! Oh, my goodness. That was more trouble than it was worth. But hey, I got enough hearts, and it didn't seem like it was any trouble at all. Okay, I'm gonna take a quick break. When we return, we'll finish the job. So, stick around, folks. Channel 84 Winnipeg. We'll be right back after these commercial messages.